In this video, we will introduce you to the most dangerous plants in nature. Plants are nature's most special gift to us. Magnificent beings existed before humanity and will continue to live after humanity. But some of them can be very dangerous. Even being in the same area, let alone touching such plants, invites death. The Himalayan blackberry is a plant you don't want to mess with. This plant covers an area of 40 square decimeters with its sharp thorns. Unlike common blackberries, the spines of the Himalayan blackberry can reach up to 5 centimeters in length. Just encountering this type of blackberry can send you to the emergency room. This innocent-looking sharp plant can cause serious eye damage, blood loss and disruption of arteries and veins. Many unfortunate incidents have occurred when hikers have fallen into the valley covered with these dangerous plants. The thorny bushes are tightly bound together, so if they are torn or cut, they can fly backwards and act like a mace, damaging the eyes. The Jimpy Jimpy tree, a plant native to Australia, is the most dangerous tree in the world and, of all the burning trees, the most painful. Jimpy Jimpy's agonizing pain is caused by the fact that it is covered in caustic acid. This plant drives those affected by its poison to suicide. A person who accidentally used the leaves of this tree as toilet paper in the forest later committed suicide with a gun. This frightening plant contains one of the most potent poisons ever detected, and the poison residues are effective for up to 20 years. This is due to the toxins contained in the poisonous thorns. This plant is so dangerous that even the best workers in Australian forests wear special clothing in potentially dangerous areas. The New Zealand stinging nettle is one of only two plants in the world that can kill a person if accidentally stepped on. This huge plant is the most poisonous of the stinging nettles. It can grow up to 4.5 meters long. This sophisticated robed plant is surrounded by large spines that can emit irritating neurotoxins that can be fatal on even the slightest contact. To avoid death, it is very important to be careful when hiking. There have been reports of people dying from touching this plant. Even if death does not occur immediately, the poison it contains can, over time, cause the nervous system to collapse. With its small, glossy leaves, it is an unpretentious plant often used in decorative gardens and public spaces. Spurge laurel is very closely related to the laurel plant. However, this laurel tree causes one of the worst deaths in the plant kingdom. It has very potent biocides, and contact with it causes irritation to the affected areas, which can turn into large wounds. Even eating a few of its fruits can cause massive internal bleeding and organ dysfunction within hours. It is interesting to note that some tribes have used this plant as a last resort medicine for the seriously ill. However, the treatment can have far worse consequences than the disease itself. The greenfinch, which lives in isolated areas, can digest the fruits of this plant without any harm. Buttercup is the most innocent-looking plant on this list, but it is one of the garden plants, that can be found almost at any time and has extra-lethal properties. It usually grows in poorly drained grassy areas and is often found by children. When the plant touches the skin, a small red spot appears on the skin. This is because the bright yellow flowers emit toxins that cause small rashes. The plant can produce severe toxicity to the digestive system, poisoning rodents that consume it. Consumption by humans can cause organ and nervous system poisoning, leading to a painful death. Clearly, the beauty of this plant is not for touching, but for watching. Giant hogweed is indeed a plant to be feared. While many plants exhibit poisonous properties when consumed, this plant can cause very serious harm to humans, even with only minor physical contact. At the same time, it has a lot of sap emission and photosensitive properties. The sap reacts instantly to sunlight and initiates a chemical reaction that blisters the skin and soft tissue, causing gangrene and the formation of purple lesions that can last for several years. Even a tiny bit of sap in the eye can cause blindness. Giant hogweed can grow up to about 2.5 meters in length. Pigs, on the other hand, are resistant to these plants. No harmful effects on pigs have yet been observed. It is found in the woodlands of the oak region of Northwest America. The edible bulbs, called camas plants, cover the landscape with their colorful flowers. Early peoples cultivated the grasslands by burning them and grew a variety of plants like this one. However, 
species related to this plant can be confused with edible camas. It is quite obvious that the death camas is the most poisonous plant in existence. Death camas is distinguished from edible camas by its soft coloration. If someone interacts with camas, it becomes a matter of life and death. Consuming even a small amount of this plant can cause sudden death due to blood corruption and organ failure. The remarkable angel's trumpet flower is a plant native to forests in South America. This plant emits a very powerful poison with a triple action called scopolamine, which has hyoscyamine, atropine and hypnotic properties. Angel's trumpet is not lethal as long as people do not touch it, and in this way, it differs from the other plants on this list. A documentary was made about Angel's Trumpet, named after a criminal gang called Colombian Devil's Breath, who extracted scopolamine from this plant and used it on their victims, turning them into zombies. Victims under the influence of this hypnotic plant are not aware of their actions, yet they are fully awake. The documentary includes several horror stories about scopolamine attacks, including the case of a man who had scopolamine powder blown in his face and had his entire house emptied by burglars. The psychotic consciousness of the volunteer subjects was also completely affected. The red tide is a terrifying phenomenon that ravages coastlines around the world. During the change of seasons, with the change in temperature, thousands of tiny seaweeds known as algae pelagius reproduce, turning the water a musty color. The algae are quickly picked up at the surface by shellfish. They have enormous neurotoxic effects. This very dangerous algae bloom can quickly paralyze secondary organs and, even worse, numb the respiratory tract when it comes into contact with infected shellfish. Rumor has it that the waters swirling around the blood became notorious for causing the death of one of the crew of Captain George Vancouver en route to Western Canada. Perhaps the red tide can explain the cause of the deaths of these mysterious sea creatures.